Can you get it, babe? Yeah. Right on cue. All right, you got another lot. Whoa. You okay? Yeah. Mm. You not get it? Mm -mm. No, I can't. Oh, it might be. Is it fighting? Yes. It is fighting? Or is it on the bottom? There we go. Is it? Oh, it's off now. No, it's not. Huh? Mm -mm, I feel it. You do? Uh -huh. It's fighting me. Okay. What is it, Bonita? Bonita. All right, we'll keep it for bait. I think he was on the bottom in the rocks or something because I couldn't get it at first. Yeah. Oh, what is that? Amberjack? It's oh. Amberjack, I think. Of course. On the jig. Elizabeth doing the jig. <laughs> yep. Uh, no. What is that? A Bonita? Bonita? <laughs> it's, it's Bonita or being something. Being chased by being Amberjack. Chased. By something else. By something else, yeah. Yeah, that's a Bonita being chased good, by... Good Bonita. Uh, Amberjack. What next? <laughs> yeah. Throw that thing in here. All right. Get it right here. We'll put it in the... Uh, that's a big old Bonita. Yeah, watch Look out, that. buddy. It was being chased by Amberjack or something. Yep. Hey, what's going on, everybody? So, um, it's another weekend. We're out here trying to pick up where we left off last weekend. Um, you just saw Elizabeth bring in a, a Bonita jigging. I was getting set up over here on a reef and uh, we're trying to catch snapper again and probably going to get into a few amberjacks. Yeah, but she we, got, can, we can see them already. She got sure. a Bonita on the jig, on that bucktail jig, and there was a school of Bonita, um, amberjack chasing the Bonita all the way up to the boat. So um, she's going to drop a penfish down now. Yep. We've got a live penfish. Yep, I'm going to drop this. And Jay's going to jig. Actually, I'm just going to film you right now dropping this down and see if this will even make it to the bottom. You see the screen here. We're in almost 100 foot, 98 foot. Let's see what we do here. First drop. First drop. Yeah, I definitely got hit right there. I can't believe nothing's hitting this finfish. Something hit you? He was just jumping around. Oh, yep. Something hit him. Oh, something just hit me too. <laughs> something hit him hard. There we go. Oh, I see it. There, there go. you go. Oh. And you had it. I did. He's still there. Still there? Mm hmm Yeah, I got hit too. Oh, there it is. There you go. There it is. I got it. It's just digging. It's just digging. It's not running like an amberjack. I hope it is a snapper. Yeah, that's exactly what it feels like. Come on. Come on. Come on. Be oh, a oh, oh. Oh, he's got hit. Nope. Freaking amberjack. Amberjack. Small one, though. That's why it, it's an Almaco. Huh, Neela? Almaco? Yep. That's why I didn't feel like an Amberjack. Oh, Ooh. there you go. All right, Neela. All right. You got, you got it. You got it. You got it. On the jig. Bucktail jig does it. Oh. You getting bit? Oh. Something on a uh, chunk of bonita. Oh. Oh, I see. oh, that's definitely not what you just had, is it? I don't think so, because I was reeling that pretty easy. Yeah. Maybe you just realized he got hooked. Maybe. Is that an amberjack? 
for something bigger. <laughs> you know, can you tell with Amberjack? I Are can't you even doing lift, anything with I it? I know. Huh? I can't even lift the pole up. You can't? There you can. There okay. you go. He stopped for a second. See, I think he's down in the wreck, though. Are you stuck? No, I'm not. Are you sure you're not stuck? No. Oh, he's still pulling. That's not pulling steady, though. I think he took you're me in down. the wreck. He took me down into the wreck. Yeah, you're in the wreck. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. oh. Holy cow. Bucktail jig does it again and does not again. Finish mackerel? I think so. <laughs> oh, you can't even get him, can you? They are so powerful. That's why they're called reef donkeys, right? <laughs> they're stubborn and. See? That's what I had on. A bonita? <laughs> Is that a bonita? Yeah, and the amberjack. The amberjacks went destroyed after it. it. Yes, look at that. Absolutely destroyed that thing. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> That's what it, they did to me a minute ago. That was a big amberjack to hit that joker, too. Wow. Look, he's not even moving. No. He got right, nailed. Get down, Elon. <laughs> wow. Or he's not fighting very hard. Uh uh. <laughs> it's a trigger fish. Nope, oh, no, it's, it's a not. mangrove snapper. It's a mangrove. Excellent. What size does it have to be? That size. Okay. Neelan? Neelan, be careful, buddy. <laughs> Perfect size right there. Okay. Mangrove's good. You're dang right. Good job. That is. Okay. That's okay. dinner okay. right there. All right, buddy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Neelan's like, heck yeah, not, that's dinner. Not Neelan's dinner. That is our dinner All right, right there. Good out. job. Nice mangrove snapper. Definitely 10. He's 13. Yeah. He's 14. Yeah. All right. Ice. Dinner. Jack. Amberjack. Yep. Another Amberjack. Another little Amico. <laughs> At first he didn't. It's not very big. Boy, that's not big, whatever that is. No, it might be another mangrove. Maybe a bee liner. A oh. uh, little grouper. <laughs> little grouper. <laughs> a baby grouper. A little gag grouper. All right. Yeah, there's fish down here. This one, other than amberjack. Yeah. Like that grouper? He's not quite big enough. Uh, well, we couldn't keep him anyway. No, we couldn't keep him anyway, but still, either even if we could, he wouldn't be big enough. Yeah. That's nice. good eating though, grouper. Boy, it is. When they're in season and when they're big enough. <laughs> All right. So we're back in the kitchen now and we're gonna cook up this mangrove snapper that we caught yesterday, actually. Uh, we had a pretty decent day out there. Um, we caught a lot of fish. We didn't catch fish that we were gonna keep, um, but we did catch quite a few amberjack. We caught some smaller um, Almaco jacks. And uh, Elizabeth caught this nice little mangrove snapper, which I think you've heard us say this before, this is probably one of our favorite snappers to eat. Um, in our opinion, it's, it's one of the best tasting snappers. So uh, we're excited to get that, bring it home, cook it up. And we're gonna do a little bit different this time than we showed you last time. I think last time maybe even a, a uh, I think that was grouper actually. This time uh, we're gonna put it on the uh, big green egg again. I'm gonna use some uh, cedar planks that are soaking in some red wine. And then Elizabeth is gonna make a um, lime cilantro sauce to go on top of it. So um, I'm gonna get this stuff prepared here, get these fillets cut off, cleaned up, make sure there's no bones in them. And then uh, we'll see you guys back out there on the grill. Fish put on the ground. What do you got going? So I've got cream cheese, 
So I'm gonna make a sauce for the fish. Yep. Um, so it's gonna take cream cheese and a little bit of truffle oil, um, a little bit of cilantro, and then I'm gonna add some lime to it. And then we'll put a little bit of water in it and it'll make a nice creamy sauce for the fish. Perfect. Okay, I've got the um, cedar planks soaked in red wine. I'm gonna put a little bit of um, olive oil on here. Elizabeth doesn't like that when I do that. It's way too much for me. She thinks it's way too much. And then this time I'm just using rosemary salt pepper because Elizabeth's gonna have a lime cilantro sauce that I'm gonna put on top. That's it, heading out to the grill. All right, I think the egg is ready. We've got this thing almost 800 degrees right now. That's a little bit overkill for these small mango snapper fillets on these cedar planks. But when I put them on there, I'm gonna shut the, the vents off. We're gonna close it up. This should be really good. and put that wine or moisture on there is so those cedar planks don't catch fire. So we're gonna shut this off, top, bottom. And you saw that temperature came down pretty dramatically. It's gonna go back up for a minute and then it'll slowly go back down. But that's not gonna take long at all. Neelan. Neilan's doing so much better, you guys, since the last time we did this. I think the last time we did this, it was right before he was going to have surgery. It's been eight weeks, almost nine weeks now. All right, it's been about four or five minutes. Let's check on this fish real quick. Still lift it pretty slowly when it's that hot. Yeah, that's already done. Doesn't take long. All right, come on, buddy. All right. Okay, finished product here. Cedar plank grilled mangrove snapper with some air fried potatoes and onions, sauteed onions and mushrooms. All right, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time here on the Real A50.